Thai New Year Songkran. Songkran originated from a Buddhist ceremony in Thailand. This is a traditional purification practice. On this day, people splash water on each other to express their blessings and wishes for the new year. Songkran takes place from April 13th to 15th and is usually celebrated with water fights, praise and banquets. The whole festival lasted for three days. People get up early to bathe and pay homage to the Buddha, and then start the celebration. During this period, everyone splashed water on each other, praying to wash away the troubles of last year and start again in the new year. The first two days of the Songkran festival are to bid farewell to the old, and the last day is to welcome the new. For Thai people, it is the happiest traditional New Year festival of the year. Songkran festival comes from Sanskrit, which means the past, implying entering a new astrology and starting a new era. During this long holiday, in the hottest April in Thailand, many urbanites return to their hometowns to reunite with their families and start praying for good luck in the new year. Young people will splash water on each other to collect good luck for a whole year. Being splashed with water these days, they will not feel angry or humiliated, because water symbolizes blessing and moreover, refreshing heat. Songkran usually lasts for three days, and people splash water in streets, parks and temples, play with water guns and sprinkle flower petals. In some cities, people also engage in mud battles, and different cultures have developed different celebrations in different places. For example, Bangkok is on Khao Sen Road, which is the favorite place for backpacks all over the world. There will be young Thais and foreigners splashing water on each other. You might get wet and dirty with water and flour from strangers with a big smile. Chiang Mai, water splashed everywhere in the old city of Chiang Mai and the surrounding roads. The eye-catching and beautiful parade and the trucks full of people sprayed water on other vehicles and pedestrians with water cannons filled with water. Ayutthaya, providing food to monks, pour water on the hands of the elderly to wish them good health, splash water on elephants, according to tradition, bathe the Buddha statue and purify the body, wear traditional costumes, enjoy parades and eat traditional food. Pattaya, get up in the morning to give alms to monks and pour spiced water on Buddha statues, pray for a good start to the new year, pour some spiced water on the hands of the elders to bless them with health, Build sand towers on the beach. Enjoy folk games and entertainment. Fukud, traditional water splashing Buddha statue. Sand dunes, giving ceremony. Bartender competition. Motorcycle parade. Various music performances. Local food. Sukho Thai, sand pagoda making competition. Songkran beauty pageant and parade of ancient shopping carts. Elephant water blessing and participate in local sports games. Kankane during the Songkran festival. The main street in the city center and the entire road of Sichuan Road are closed. Vehicles are prohibited and turned into a splashing water park. This road was also changed to an interesting name Romi Road. Young people celebrate by splashing water, throwing flour at each other, dancing, eating and drinking. In addition, there are many concerts and cultural events. Festive foods for Songkran include Kao Chai which is a mixture of rice and various side dishes. Khao Tang Mud, which is steamed with glutinous rice wrapped in banana leaves, minced pork and mushrooms, fried rice noodles, shrimp, and chopped eggs song tang, a hot and sour salad of green papaya, tomato, chili and peanuts, jasmine and pandan leaves stuffed with sweet, shredded coconut, and aromatic syrupy dessert called Kanam Tang. And Kanam Krog, a coconut small round cakes made with milk, glutinous rice flour, and brown sugar, and plenty of street food stores, including kebabs, fried chicken, and desserts like mango sticky rice and coconut ice cream. Thailand has many traditional festivals throughout the year, and you must experience the joyous atmosphere of Songkran at least once in your life. Tips for participating in Songkran activities Watch the festivities with a playful heart and don't get mad at getting wet. It's a traditional Thai way of greeting the new year. Wear light, dry clothes, put your wallet, mobile phone, and camera in a plastic bag and put them away. Bring a small bucket or water gun to join this lively and fun splashing party. 
have a water fight with a smile. I will see you next time. Go make go get home.